Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim. And uh, if you uh, notice here, we are in a slightly different place to where we left off last time. As we left off last time, we had uh, returned to Solitude after finishing up at the Thalma Embassy. And now we appear to be, the more eagle-eyed among you, in the Reach. Yes we are, that's correct. <laughs> So why the hell have we skipped from Solitude to the Reach, you may ask. Now those of you on my forums will know exactly what happened, but for those of you that aren't, I had a bit of a calamity yesterday. I recorded an hour, twenty minute session of Skyrim. I'll outline what I did. And uh, at the end of the session I stopped the recording, hoping to uh, get it edited and uploaded, and as I ended the recording, I was informed that the recording had failed. So I'd lost a one hour, twenty pl uh, play session. So I had two choices. I could either play the session again, or I could do what I'm going to do now, which is outline what happened during the session and continue from where I left off at the end of yesterday's corrupted session. Because if it was a 45 minute session, I wouldn't mind as much as uh, playing it again, but an hour 20, it's a long time to play it all again. So, uh, as much as it pains me, I'm going to just carry on and, and outline what happened in the last session. So what did happen in the last session? Well. <laughs> quite a lot, to be perfectly frank with you. Of all the sessions to miss, we missed one which really we could have done with watching. I started off in solitude, obviously, after finishing up at... Uh, how the hell do I get down from here? After finishing up in the Thalma Embassy, I slept in the Winking Skeever... not Winking Skeever, do apologize. Is it, yes, it is a Winking Skeever. Slept in the Winking Skeever for the last time for a while. Elwyn sipped on his Colovian brandy, which he picked up in the Thalma Embassy, commented that it was extremely uh, strong compared to the spiced wine he usually drinks. Had a great night's sleep, knocked out by the, by the uh, Colovian brandy. He still has some of it left. He only had a couple of, couple of cups, but that was enough. Boy, it was potent stuff. And uh, we left. We left Solitude. It was sort of a, a little, a little goodbye to Solitude. Quite a nice area, but we're not going to be returning there anytime soon, I don't think. And uh, we set off, not to the Rift, which is where the next quest pretty much lay. But we had to first of all go to Riverwood. So we got the carriage to Whiterun, went to Riverwood, got our stuff back from Delphine, updated her with what was going on. There is a. Holy cow, this doesn't sound good. This doesn't sound good. Right, there's a ca- Oh, shooting beds and moly moly moly! I'm trying to concentrate here, it's not working. Kind's peace! There's two of them! There's two of them! I'm being mauled! Come get me, Barry. <laughs> Holy cow. What the hell's going on here? I'm in the middle of a war zone. I'm trying to get to my location here and I keep getting disturbed. I'm trying to get to my location. Leave me be. Apparently there's a cave somewhere near here where I need to get inside. Reach water rock. Uh, I hate water. How do I get into this? How do I get in to reach water rock? <laughs> How do I get in to reach water rock? Somebody tell me please. Is there a door? Is that it? I need to get out of here, man. I'm in grave danger. I'm sopping wet through. Is it through back of here? Ah! <laughs> We're in! Oh dear. So what was I saying? Yes, what I was saying was we left Solitude, we went to Riverwood, we told Delphine about what happened, about the fact that the Thalma do not know about the dragons returning. 
we got our equipment back, and then she sent us to the rift. Rather unsurprisingly. If I uh, uncover this here, uh, a cornered rat. There we go. She told us to go and speak to Brynjolf. We are looking for Espen, who knows a bit about the dra dragons returning, we think. So that's where we're going. So did we go to the rift? No, we didn't. <laughs> because I wanted to finish off a quest. A couple of quests, in fact. So if we go to the map, what I did is uh, we went to, to Whiterun. Obviously, we went to Riverwood, and then from there we walked from Riverwood, not quite to the rift, but we walked to here, to Gaiman's Hall, because we had that quest for the Galda legend, the final piece of the necklace, the final fragment of the amulet was here in Gaiman's Hall, so it's kind of on the way to the rift. So we went there, fought our way through Gaiman's Hall, through countless Draugr, and uh, whilst we were there, we actually also used Jazago's Flame sc Cloak Scrolls, <laughs> so we've actually completed that quest finally. How many, how many months has this been waiting? Uh, so we've done that as well. We picked up the final piece of the amulet, and uh, it sent us here. It sent us all the way back to here, in Marka, to reach Water uh, Rock. And our quest now is to forge the amulet, reforge the Galda amulet. It's in three bits, we've come here to put it back to one and hopefully it'll be an amulet that we can use. So that's what happened last session. Quite a bit. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we lost it all. But that's what happened, so uh, that's why we're here. And that's what we're doing, and after we've finished here, we'll head to Markaf, get the carriage back to Winterhold, and then from there, it's to the Rift. <laughs> I'll get there eventually. So hopefully this session will not crash on us. As I pick up some mushrooms. So here we are, I don't know what this cave holds for us. Elwyn, of course, getting a little bit wet to start the session, always lovely. Always lovely. This place is full of water, so he's going to have to make do. We'll use a flame cloak spell to dry ourselves off once we're done. But uh, I have no idea how big this place is, or if it just contains a single little room with a nice altar or something to reforge this amulet. I don't know what we're going to do to reforge it, how it's going to be reforged through magical means or otherwise but I'm sure we're about to find out. So uh, I was a little bit I was a little bit frustrated that we lost the session, not just because of the fact that obviously we actually completed or, or advanced three quests, the main quest and the two side quests, particularly the Jazago Flame Cloak uh, scroll quest, which had been, we've been looking to do for some time, <clears throat> but because of the fact that... Oh, look at that, it's there. Because Elwin actually, we, we uh, Elwin, me, whatever, which way, which way you want to look at it, actually uh, was fairly proficient in the dungeon, fighting all the, the, the Draugr. We used a variety of spells. We used the Paralyze, we used some of our Turning Undead spells, obviously we summoned Fluffy, we used, uh, you know, we used some of our Shouts. We were qu quite effective in solo combat. And uh, unlike the debacle in the Thalma Embassy, we were Elwin looked far more apt. Emerald Dragon Claw. He looked far more comfortable fighting on his own. But we might see that here now. Lost Legends. I think I've got this one. Minor healing, not too bothered about, and not the armor either. So we have an ancient edict. Let this place be forgotten forever, let it be struck from the rolls of history, let it never be spoken of by man or mer, let its very name be lost to the ages. Ye who enter here know, this place was sealed at great price. Honour those who perished here, turn back and leave them to their rest. Hmm. You think I've come all this way to, uh, to turn back now? You've got to be kidding. 
<laughs> You've got to be kidding. Yeah, and we also leveled up, but I'm not going to... Oh, well, I'll spend the point. I'll uh, spend the points in Magicka. Uh, but we we do have a perk. Two perks to, to use. I am actually waiting till we get to Destruction Level 75. So I can use the Expert... Or, or obtain the Expert Destruction perk. So that I can start using my Expert Destruction spells for far less Magicka cost. Because they're not quite magicker efficient at the moment. Okay, so the old Emerald Claw. We need to look at it and uh, obtain the right pattern, the right order of uh, of these little animals. Bear. What the hell is that? Bear, dolphin, snake. And open sesame. Oh wow, look at that. Does it just fill you with chills seeing that happen there? All these doors just opening up in sort of synchronized fashion. Wow. Okay. Anything gonna like, pop out on us? Gonna like, jump out? Give us a surprise? Lock us in and ambush us? Who knows? Well, we're tentatively walking down the corridor. The eerie atmosphere. The opening of the doors. Here we have a slightly different situation. Because we have another door. This time, though, we seem to have no claw. Ah! Shoot! Well, it, one claw seemed to fit into that. Now, I don't know what claw it was, or how I've managed to pick up a claw that fits that. This ivory dragon claw, how the hell does this work? Where did I pick this ivory dragon claw up, and how does it fit into here? I'm not even going to question it. I'm just going to, I'm just going to uh, assume that this is the right claw. Uh, eagle, eagle, dragonfly, or whatever the hell that thing is. Flying thing. So, eagle, eagle, flying thing. If this works, I'll be bamboozled as to where I got this ivory dragon claw from. Wow. Where did I get that dragon claw from? I don't recall getting it. But it fit here perfectly. Oh, unless I picked it up. Unless I picked it up in one of the, in the other Galder places. In one of the other... I, I think I remember... I think I remember now. I think I do remember picking it up in one of the uh, other areas for the Galder quest. It's coming back to me. It's coming back to me. And that's why I couldn't stash it away. I tried to un I tried to get rid of it into my uh, into my storage in my quarters in the College of Winterhold, and it wouldn't let me. It said it cannot remove quest item. That's because I still had a use for it. Once I finish this quest, I might be able to get rid of it and put it in my uh, stash. It's coming. It's making sense now. It's, make, it's all falling into place. Right. Righty, righty, right. Okay. Get my bearings. This seems to be openable. Hidden door. So far, so good. I'm just wondering where all the enemies are. 
as soon as I say that, they all pop out in front of me. Fair enough. Oh, this looks like some kind of big fight. Looks like I'm going to be locked in here. As I delve through, I'm going to be locked in and ambushed. Right on cue. <laughs> you couldn't give me a few pitiful draug to practice on first so I can get my eye in, get my aim up, you know? <laughs> All I've done so far is run away from a bear and fall into some water and... Uh, Really not good practice for defeating a real evil legend here. Uh, yeah. Let's just say I'm not happy about this. So much so that I'm gonna summon Fluffy, because I know things are gonna go awry here. And then I think we'll start with Fireball. Right guys, let's get ready for some fun. <laughs> right, better hurry up. Activate amulet pedestal. Oh, one has been placed. Two have been placed. Three have been placed. Oh! Don't kill me, please. I'm just here. Oh! Oh! Uh, how many of these things are there? Holy smokes. Come on, Fluffy! Ah! Suck on that, punks! Suck on that! No! Uh. Mikrul Galderson! I'm getting shot with arrow fire! Pretty accurate arrow fire, it has to be said. And, 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 and flame and frost! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Don't worry, I'm here. Gotcha. Yes. 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 Okay, we're just about living here. We're just about living. No problems yet. Come on. I have to be careful with this grand heal that I don't heal the enemy. It's fine. Mid battle. I'm going to level up. Expert destruction. Yes, please. Now I can use my expert destruction spells, the likes of incinerate, the likes of something else. Just concentrate on this for now. Let's try it. Hey, <laughs> burn, baby, burn, burn that mother down. Uh oh, looks like another one is stepping down. To take up the mantle. Uh oh. Where's he morph? He's morphing! He's morphing! Sigdis! Wow. Sigdis was tough. Sigdis was the brother that I fought in the last session that we lost, and he was tough. He kept morphing, he kept using his shout. Oh, he's using it again! 
Oh! Uh, don't worry, this is fine, this is fine. This is fine. What? Let's have a look what else we have. Ice Storm. I want to use one of the new Storm Call Thunderbolt. Is it Thunderbolt? And I think. Dual cast incinerate should do the trick. Should be very powerful. Oh! Woo! Ah! Ugh. Oh, don't worry. I'm fine. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. We need to find the proper guy. We need to find the real Sigdis and finish him off. He's got a whole host of thralls. I don't have enough magicka. Nice. Oh, seems like things have just kicked off a little bit here. Will the real sickness please show yourself? Ah, he's not the real one, he's a fake. Find the real one, and then we shall be free. Find the real one. Who is he? Which one is it? Who is the real sickness? You? Yep, he's a real one. Got him! 